Baby, what did I do wrong? Everything. <laughs> good morning good morning good afternoon and good night you guys i just finished working out i just finished killing a workout session i i did work out extra early this morning because my aim is to go to church and i have a bunch of stuff that i want to get done before i head out this morning hopefully you guys are having a good day whatever it is that you're doing today have fun doing it stay blessed doing it stay encouraged doing it and make sure you guys get your workout in it doesn't really matter what time of day it doesn't really matter what you have to do today just squeeze in a little 30 sec 30 minutes goes a long long way can you imagine if you do 30 minutes workout for at least three days of the week the amount of progress that you see over that time and i won't preach to you anymore about doing your workouts <laughs> i am going to do my morning routine my morning routine as usual baby's still in bed i think he's a little bit tired so baby's still in bed tell us around here tell i wake up extra early this morning just like yesterday but that's okay i still get to get i uh, still get a chance to do what i want to do the fact that he was up early maybe if he was up late i would still be in bed and i wouldn't get my workout in so it's a blessing in disguise i i am going to um I'm going to make my green juice because I'm sure Tyler is looking forward to that and then get breakfast done and get ourselves ready for church. Tyler is here. Tyler, can you say morning, Fizz? Morning. What you doing? Mm. Tell them that we're going to church. Mm. Tell Fizz that we're going to church. He's not in the talking mood this morning. He wants his tablet. So look at him looking at me. <laughs> He's a hot mess. Anyway, you guys, I'm going to um, make my green juice, make breakfast. I'm gonna see if I can also make lunch and dinner before I leave out this morning. Don't know how that's gonna how that's gonna go yet because I really don't know what's on our menu for today. But let's see. <music> to step out for work and this is what I decided to cook today for dinner that's quinoa here and this is some chicken breast I sauteed here and then for lunch I make shrimp with bean sprouts and we're gonna have that with panadillas all right so that's that for lunch and dinner and <coughs> we are heading out for church right now that's babe's church ready you look sweet honey and mini church ready we're ready for church you ready yes okay let's go all right let's go now church ready 
Get your son. Alright, let's go. He's gone. The face. Really, honey. Hey guys, <laughs> we just switched the church. Um, Tyler's sleeping, so not gonna talk Stop. loud. Uh, so we are a little bit in advance, like 15 minutes. So probably we're gonna stay in the car and a little relax. bit, relax, and let Tyler have him. Because yeah, maybe when I take him up, he's gonna wake up. Oh uh, yeah, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. You should be tired. Who me? Yeah. I am because Tyler woke up before six this morning calling mama i am very hungry <laughs> am very who wake up and says they're hungry oh my gosh so i've been up with him and let babe sleep this morning and no i am feeling it anyway you guys we're just gonna chill here until church begin in about 10 or so minutes church church was awesome 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 real quick the message at church today was about adam and eve disobeying god in the garden and how he came about to eating the apple when he told when god told him not to and all of that so that was that church was good and we st we stuck around and mingle with um the people at church a bit and now we're back home and about to have lunch the good thing is see my instinct never wrong when i do this when i cook and stuff before i go off to to wherever i'm going i can come back home and don't even worry ha about cooking always follow your instinct and you'll never go wrong at least it works for me so this is lunch for babe and i and for lunch i had made um some shrimp with bean sprouts and i'm just putting them in some panadillas and lunch is about to go down for babe and i and tyler is already eating tyler is having hot dog and a yogurt <gasps> you're eating yes what you're eating good all right enjoy you want some of this one all right i'll soon give you some ready to grab them Mm -hmm. You guys, Tyler decided that he wanted to paint, one of his favorite activities to do, so he's doing just that right now. painting fun quoi, ça, painting number one you have so much fun doing it he, this boy loves to paint thank god that he's not a kid that marks on the wall super love painting wow cool he's now gone from painting to coloring 
<laughs> hmm? What's that? Is it yes from a queen? This is a flashback queen. All right, go and color. Use your colors. Use these and color on the book. <laughs> he just wanna drive. Baby. Listen, our toddler is at a stage where he talks non-stop. Tyler just talk all day. I don't know where Tyler gets his energy from, but I need to do something about his energy level. <laughs> anyway, you guys, we are coming on to end the vlog and give you guys the expressions. And this one just pop up in my head just now so the jamaican expression for today is galang if you hear a jamaican say to you gal galang dong deso or galang aya bed simple mean go on the word galang mean go on go to your bed go down there galang dong deso or go on your bed galang yes galang galang mm -hmm. Okay. What's the French expression? Mm, the French expression is avoir un cheveu sur la langue. Okay. To have a hair in the, in the tongue. Do <laughs> you know what I mean? No. Um, to have a hair in the tongue simply means when somebody talking about the, the, the like the, 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 like you can't he understand and t -t -t -t. Okay. you say he like a shiver so long or depend. I'm I'm not talking in about in Jamaica. I would say I chat gibberish. Okay, I'm not talking about person who, who do that. You're not talking about list. No, I'm not right. talking about gibberish. They talk talking and they about... can't understand anything. Yeah. Uh -huh. Nothing about we somebody. We call it gibberish in the book. Right. Avoir un cheveu sur la langue. Avoir un cheveu sur la langue. Bébé! What did I do wrong? Everything. Oh <laughs> Say it again. Avoir un cheveu sur la langue. Okay, it's a little bit better. So what did I do different? I only said faster this time. Yeah, but the way you say it, you, you, <laughs> you eat every word. <laughs> That's another expression. Eat the word. You say that the next time. <laughs> anyway, you guys, there you have the Jamaican and the French expression for today. You get it? Make sure you get it. All right, you guys. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below. Subscribe if it's your first time to the fam. Bam. Catch up and keep up. We love, love, love you guys. And we'll see you guys wow. tomorrow.